Hello everyone, my name is Silverweed and welcome back to Stormheart Expansion Pack. Okay, we shouldn't step in the water. We have to put up the signs. Oh most impressive. Because we got the signs from Topknot in the last episode. Welcome back! I hope Topknot's artistic side didn't scare you too much. Uh, can you sort it out for me? We dug some dirt moles on either side of the vernal pool that hold the signs. You just need to click the closer. Click the closer of mold of mold mo 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 of dirt mold mo mo. Thanks, pal. You know that sign doesn't look half bad. Whoa! Digging these molds really eased the tension in my shoulders. Take it from me. Sweating really cools out the anger. Click on the dirt mold by me. Where is dagger? Dagger's here too. Dagger. <gasps> Dagger's here. Dagger, be my best friend, please. I love it. Sorry. Little flying worm parasites of the Grimora aren't my thing, but you know what? They are exactly Heather style. Ha! I love my weird little sister. Let's talk to her at the school together. Wow, you're so freaky, Dagger. You're so freaking creepy. Uh, yeah, school, I guess. All right, Heather is here. Let's talk to. Oh, okay, Dagger is here. Ready for an adventure? Silver and Dagger. What a pleasant surprise! Unlike some Grimora we know. Who would have thought Hobbergrund Island would become so dangerous overnight? Hiccup and I have been talking about what we can do. I hope we can find something. Yeah, I hope so too. You should check it out. Speaking of accidental exposure to surprise, supremely dangerous things, Johan has been asking for you. I wonder if it's about the conversation you had with Stormheart. Can you talk to Johan? I was kidding about the dangerous thing, of course. Johan is a deer. <laughs> wow. Alright, I guess. Johan is uh, here at school. Johan, come to me. Come to me, Johan. Johan's training post. I am in dire need of your assistance. I am so flustered I can barely think straight. Earlier this week, I was at Auction Island acquiring a set of rare gears that would be perfect for Hiccup's Dragon Eye project. A group of ruffians stole my boat with the package in it. It is imperative that we get the ship and the goods back. It's a unique ship with a horned dragon figurehead. Please, good viking, can you help me out? Sounds like a trip to auction island is in order. Sorry, not so sorry for eavesdropping. That place is a festering pit of villainy, but I'll watch your back. I'll wrap this up quicker than you can say, rock and rock. Five times over. Off to our auction island. I was supposed to say account I island, but I doubt that there were account uh, accounts in uh, in Viking Age. But we go to auction island. Breathe in and let the smell of this place soak into your bones, silver. This is the good stuff. The scent of salt water and danger. How can anyone ask for more? In case you're confused about my name, just try to read it backwards and you will not be confused anymore. Heather made me promise that I'll let you do all the talking and that's probably for the best. So lead on! Let's find some scoundrel who's ready to spit his guts. Figuratively, I promise. Right, sure. Arid is here! Arid, son of Arid, you're my best friend. Please marry me. Arid, look at me. Look at me, Arid. I know I'm a kid, but can we please? I promise I will be a good wife. Come, come. Oh, I can live on your head. Yes. Arid! I'm sorry. Okay, I'm sorry. Let's just Let's move on. Find someone who's willing to talk. Hmm. Uh, interesting. I just go alone. Yeah, okay. Well, bye bye, everybody. Bye bye, dagger. Bye bye, Arid. I will find someone who talks. Someone who's willing to talk. Jump! Jump around! Jump around! Where? Hmm. 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 Ah, here's a buffoon. A horn dragon ship? I don't think I've seen any of those around here recently. I'll need a little something if you want to jog my memory. You know, you look a little familiar. I don't think I like the look of your face. Well, thanks. Yikes. He looks like he wants to pick a fight. You should look for someone else to ask about Johan's boat before he gets violent. This guy? Nah, he's a, he's, a, he's a doozy. I can take him. Why is this uh, whispering death so tiny? It's a bit weird, but okay. Hmm. There was a fight about that ship earlier this week. I was surprised. 
We haven't had a proper fist fight here in a month, and the skinny guy didn't seem the fighting type. I was busy so I didn't get to watch. What a tragedy. I think the other guy mentioned that the ship was going to make a stop at Scottaclaw Island. Maybe you'll find it there. Wow, he's helpful. Thanks a lot. You got a knack for this detective stuff. Have you ever considered a change in scenery? I could use a sharp wits and a keen eye at Soccer Island. Odin knows Gustav didn't work out. Well, look at us. We're getting a little ahead of ourselves, aren't we? We need to clean our plate before we can eat delicious yak pudding. Skullacle Island, ho! Pudding? Yak pudding? That's disgusting, Dak. Look for the- oh, there it is. Whoa. What's going on here? Uh, is that a squirrel? Oh, that's a rider, right? That's a triple strike. What is going on? Ah! <laughs> It looks like the ship has some guardians. I'm so glad I tagged along. I love a challenge. Hmm. What do you think those things are, Slaughter? They look a little bit like hiccups targeting dummies. Except they're moving on their own. How is that happening? Whatever. They're standing on or away, but not for much longer. Take out their weapons, dear uh, Silver, I'm sorry. <laughs> Silver! Fire on the crossbow and destroy it. It's a long history with that name, but it was the only option I had, so just go with it. Alright, go back. That's one. It looks like they plan on raising some objections. It must be my lucky day! As always, my trusty crossbow is armed and ready. I am ready to fight if you are. Land on the ship and we'll crush these things. I am on the ship. Oh. And not a battle! The trade ship. A play! Whoa. Oh, Slyther is here. Slyther, Slyther. I know, I, am I even saying it wrong? Slyther? Well, we know what to do, so let's just kill this guy. Whoa. Where are we going? Oh my god. Hey! Dagger speaks to me. That's pretty cool. Well, I can't see. Can we move the camera, please? <laughs> Okay, stop. Hey. Okay, just take uh, a step. Go for it. Go for it. Did you do? Yeah, I did something. Hey! Hey! Ooh. Hey! Hey! Ha <laughs> Okay, this is very, very... Hey! Defense self only, okay. Hey! Hey! Yeah, he can defend himself. So, it's okay. I'm just gonna end up here and I'm so confused. <laughs> oh no, two dry, two one, two, two. Demon, uh. Mechanical kind of things on the spoiler, that's not good. Can he die though? I don't. I hope not. There you go. It died from it, awesome. There you go. Throw it. Yeah. Oh, it almost died, awesome. Spoiler, finish it off. Don't miss, please. There we go. Good, how many? Two? Two more? Oh my god, a million more, never mind. I thought I got the laugh wrong. Look at sounds listen to that. <laughs> Alright, silver. So, uh, it's my turn. Oh, uh, 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 I don't oh well. I'm still half confused by this system, it's very weird. I missed them. Well, what is that? Die. Uh, there you go. Critical, but not right now. Uh, I can only go here. Do 
do it too. Attack if you must. I wish the dragon's attack were more powerful because it's a freaking dragon. Like dagger is more powerful than slaughter in this scenario, which is a little bit. He's almost dead, come on. Shoot. Powerful and shoot him to splendors. That was enough. Yeah. There you go. That should do it, right? And what do we get? Instead of carrying around the Book of Dragons, Fitness carries what with him when he needs to look up uh, unfamiliar dra dragon cards. Okay. Where do earthquakes occur? Along fault lines and plate edges, along rivers and streams, between urban and rural areas, in the middle of the earth's in the middle of the earth plates. Not ah, what? Well, that what I meant. It's like when they collide, earth plates, right? No, volcanoes. Did they say volcano? I was thinking about earthquakes. Did they say earthquakes? Earthquakes happen when they collide. Oh, never mind. I didn't read it right. It was my bad, I guess. During an eruption, how hot can lava generally get? Got lucky. Oh, five gems. I'm again. Pompeii, an ancient city in Italy, was destroyed by what natural disaster? Panic eruption. But how would Vikings know this stuff? School dragons, you're being so very weird. So very weird. Woo! Justice is served and good wins. Destroying things feels so much better when you are on the side of good. I should have switched sides ages ago. How does he even laugh? I don't know. <laughs> Something along the lines of that. Now to reap fruits of a labor, let's go look for Johan's crate of goods. Alright, Johan's crazy crates. Yeah, a lot of crates here. You know, Johan doesn't seem like the purple swirly type to me. Do you think this symbol belongs to him? If I had to guess, I'll bet this belongs to Stormheart. Well, we can't just leave it stranded here, anyone. Where anyone can take it. Click on the crate and grab all the contents out of there. We'll make sure to get it back into the right hands. Alright. Okay, we're going to take this boat into safe waters while you get some answers from Johan. We got some, he got some explaining to do. Let's go, Slaughter, my stalwart companion. Sailing might be slower than your usual base, but I'll show you how to properly rig a ship. Everyone could always learn new skills, and who knows, maybe you'll save my life with it one day. Well, really, Dragon? Dragon? Dragon. Oh dear, I have unwittingly placed you in a terrible predicament. I forgot that I had sold a ship with the same figurehead to Harold a few weeks earlier. That ship must have belonged to his new employer, Stormheart. I feel like the biggest fool. Please, take this small gift. A beehive and a beehive tree, gee thanks. I promise to talk to Harold and do what I can to mitig mitigate this disaster. Please inform Hiccup of what happened, along with my sincerest apologies. Tell Hiccup what happened. Alright, I'll tell Hiccup what happened. Johan messed up! That's what happened. That's what happened here. I don't think that's right. Oh no. Oh no. Well, maybe we'll be able to talk reasonably and avoid a confrontation. It was an accident. If we return her goods, there's no harm. No foul, right? Oh! Archaeologist! Hiccup and Silver! If I may interrupt, give me the cargo you recovered from the ship and I can return it to its rightful owner at Auction Island. Dragons are and well looked upon there, and since Muddle isn't with me, I am confident that I can do this. I appreciate the thought behind it. Are you sure, Skulder? We don't know much about Nikora Stormheart. I hope that this problem gets smoothed over quickly, but if it doesn't, this could get dangerous. Hiccup, you and Silva have helped me in my darkest moments. It is my honor to be able to return the favor. Please keep it a crate of goods, Silva. Why is he here all of a sudden? That seems so random. Archaeologist is here. 
And his name is not Argy, his name is Scalder. Freaking Scalder. Yes, take it. My word! This is a lot of stuff. Don't worry, my dear friend. I'll make sure that this gets into the right hands. I will prove worthy of your trust and hiccup as well. You'd be doing me a huge favor. Can you go to Dragon Edge and catch Dagger up on the events? I'm sure I can go to Dragon Edge. So, what's the verdict? Are we going to war? Hiccup, my poor naive brother. You and I can see it, right, Silver? The chance that Stormheart will not retaliate is less than zero. We better strap on our armor and get ready. This won't be easy. Alright. Listen, I used to think Hiccup was my enemy, and I got incensed every time he did one of his noble yet terribly conven inconvenient to dagger things. Stormheart and I are cut from the same cloth, in fact. I would bet all the axes on Berserker Island that she is on her way here right now. It doesn't matter that it was a mistake. Hiccup has one of his fancy telescopes here, right? Click on the telescope and scan or horizon for or enemies. Alright, Dagger. Anything you say, Dagger? Dagger, please, please, Dagger. Why is the quest not loading? Come on! Where's the telescope? It's. it's did the quest kick in? I don't know what's going on. There you go. Alright. Take telescope of Dragon's Edge. I forgot where it is. There it is. Alright. She cannot come to Dragon's Edge. Are you crazy? That ship is. That ship is uh, humongous. Hello, Stoneheart. In the corner. Stoneheart. I'm scared. Is anybody else scared? We have reason to be scared. Oh my god, there's a drill below it? Was that, was that really? No, no that's, those are the. Okay, okay, that's okay. What? She's coming over here because we took her loot or something? Her box? I knew it! I would have done the same thing, hey. I did this to Hiccup back in the day. Help me out! Now's not the time, Dagger. We need to deal with this angry triple strike before we can even think about Stormheart. I'm counting on you. Silver, it's time to turn on the noisemakers we installed all around Dragon's Edge and we'll free her from the Grimora. Click on each of the devices and stay clear of the triple strike. Dagger and I will distract her until they're on. Go! Alright, alright. Where is- whoa, 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 is there one up here? I don't know, where do you put them? You didn't tell me. Oh, there's one here. Ah, ah, ah. Put it on. And this one. Oh, land. Go on, come on, don't wanna go it. Go at it. There should be a third one. Here. Did it work? Did it work? It's working. You and Hiccup always blow me away. Your genius is really. I need a bit of assistance. Astrid, I brought the box of salad water from the harbor like we planned. Silver, click on the buckets and splash the triple strike. That should make all the Grimoire flee in terror. All right, let's go, let's go, let's go. Where did he go though? Where is he? Is he? Oh, he's here. Oh, she's here. I'm sorry, it's a female. Here, here, here. here. Come on. I haven't got all day. She did not like this. What the? Oh my god! Oh, what the hell's going on? Um, urgent matter right here. Uh, that didn't work. That didn't work. Why didn't that work, Hiccup? Please, help me out. I don't know why the fish things, but we're going to have to figure it out later. Her statue sprayed something into the air, and it, it's no accident that these wild dragons landed here. She's up to something. Silver, can you shoo these dragons away from here? I think Dragon Edge is about to turn into a battlefield, and I don't want these guys to get hurt. Click on the deadly ladder and shoo him away. Where is the ladder? Oh, yeah. Shoo! Shoo away! Go! Go forth! 
Leave this place. Don't look at me like that. Go, 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 go. Why aren't you going? Hiccup is not working. They're shooting at us, really? They're shooting grimoires at us. Whoa! <laughs> oh no, I oh know! I think the grimoire has latched onto all of the wild dragons. They're going to go berserk at any moment. Let me step in here. Going berserk is my specialty. If we can't free them from the grimoire and venom, we need to drive them away. Axe out, Silver. Let's scare, scar, scar these dragons away from our base. Okay, defeat dragon tactics battle. Okay, so we have another battle on our hands. But I'll have to end this episode right here. I know it's really exciting and it's I'm really hyped for it as well. But you have to wait for in the next episode. Thank you so much for watching. And I can't wait to see what happens next. And I'll hopefully see you there. So long, dragon fighters.